Good morning, thanks for joining us for Local 3 News, I'm Rebecca Bartlemay. Joining me via video chat this morning is John Pepin with the Michigan DNR. We're talking about water safety and John, what would you like people to know before heading out on the water? There's a lot of people that have um, been unfortunately meeting with um, tragedies this uh, summer throughout the state, some at state parks and elsewhere. And uh, some of the things that people need to re remember um, first and foremost are to pay attention to uh, the flag warning systems that are at beaches, to keep an eye on um, kids if you have kids to watch or um, maintain um, an eye on anybody who's out swimming if you, if you happen to see somebody in danger um people you know it's uh, reacting quickly that's going to make um a big impact also um uh, there's a lot of incidents that have occurred based on um, weather conditions when there's uh, weather conditions or wave conditions or currents that don't lend themselves to swimming people have disregarded that and gone out and been swimming anyway and so there's currents that are naturally around like piers and things like that. But then there's also the rip currents and some of those we have in Lake Superior and elsewhere. Um, but uh, it's just um, um, another reminder for folks to just, you know, keep good head on their shoulders when they're out at the beach um, enjoying the summer. We've had so many more people out at the beach, partly probably because a lot of people are off for vacations and then also because it's such a, uh, a warm summer too, a lot of folks are out doing that. But it's something that's unfortunately become a um, repetitive incident this summer is uh, beach tragedies.